Hello everyone, happy to see you here and in this video we are going to solve this really interesting and very simple math problem and you are going to be surprised that many of you are actually going to get this wrong. So I don't want you to use your calculator right here because as you can see very simple question 90 plus 90 divided by 3. So what is the correct answer? Of course most of you out there are like yes I can handle this problem, I can handle this, this is basic addition, basic division, I learned this stuff in the third grade, so that's fantastic. So go ahead and put your answer into the comment section and I'm going to show you here the correct a correct answer here in just 30 seconds so we will check our answer i swear it will be really interesting so we can easily check your algebra skill your math skill right here okay here is our question because obviously whatever order we select is going to create a different answer right so we need to understand what is the correct order to do this problem but before solving this problem i want to write this solution to this problem and i'm not going to tell that this is correct or incorrect i have this question so 90 plus 90 divided by 3 and I don't want to tell that this is correct or incorrect, but a lot of students solve it like that. They say, okay, 90 plus 90 equal to 180, yeah, and 180 divided by 3, we have right here, still, we still have division, so equal to 60, we have this option A, which is the first one, so obvious solution, this is option option A. But I not tell that this is correct or incorrect, I'm going to show that we need to know about the correct order of operation, because it's not a correct order, it looks like not a correct order of operation. But if you look to the order of operation, for example, we have PMDMC order of operation, this is the main popular order of operation in the world, we can easily see that if we have our question right here, so 90 plus 90, divided by 3 and this PMDMC works from the top to the bottom. Let's look at this PMDMC order of operation. So the first step is parentheses. So parentheses. Are there any parentheses right here? No, I don't see any of those. We don't have any parentheses, so we just go to the next step. What about exponents right here? Are there any exponents right here? No, I don't see any of those. We don't have any exponents right here, squares, cubes, which is really great. What is the next step? The next step is multiplication and division part. And if you look closely to our question, we can easily see that right here we have one division sign. So we need to start from this division because division is before addition. Yeah, as you can see right here, division is before addition. So let's divide right here. 90 divided by 3 equal to equal to 30. And we still have this 90. So we have like 90 plus 30 equal to 120. Yeah. So we have this the, this answer right here, but then a lot of students say, okay, but we don't have this option right here. We have 60, we have like something like 5 factorial and 45. And then a lot of students go back to this 60, to this wrong answer, of course, because they don't have this option 150 in, in option section, yeah? And right now our answer is the, the next one. This is absolutely incorrect approach because this is wrong order of operation, so we reject this, reject this answer. But what about a correct option right here? Because we know that this is not 60, this is not like 45, this is 120, but we don't have this option right here. But if we look closely to these options, we have something like 5 factorial. Let's look at it. So 5 factorial, this is a product from 1 to 5, or like 10 factorial, for product from 1 to 10, like a product from 1 until this number, yeah? So we have 1 times 2 times 3 times 4 and times 5. Let's look at it. So 1 times 2 equal to 2, yeah? 2 times 3 is 6, 6 times 4 24, and 24 times 5, yeah, this is really great. This is equal to, to 120, so we can easily say that 1 to 5 factorial equal to 120, and our answer will be option B. We can easily write out here our answer, so our answer, this is option, option B, this is our answer, yeah? So my solution to this problem is the next one, option B is a correct answer, a lot of students do this common mistake, they add it first, then divide, and they don't see the answer, so as you can see, 5 factorial is a correct answer to this problem. So I hope you enjoyed this video, I hope your answer is the same as mine, but if you made this error, I'm happy you made this, because you won't make this again, and we just remember or learn about factorials. Okay, definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong. Now if you need to learn basic math, interesting brain test, IQ question, you can easily subscribe to my channel, I really appreciate it. I definitely wish you all the best in your mathematic adventures. Thank you for your time and have a great day.